Hello, welcome to JXJ Aviation. In this video, we will be looking at GPS jamming, GPS spoofing, and their effects on an aircraft. First, let's see why GPS is required in an aircraft. An aircraft uses GPS information for accurate and continuous position computation during all phases of flight. This position computation is used for aircraft navigation. GPS also provides reference time information for the aircraft's clocks. Different systems on an aircraft, such as ADSB, fuel, data communication, backup speed, enhanced GPWS, use GPS information. Now let's look at GPS jamming and GPS spoofing. What is GPS jamming? GPS jamming refers to blocking GPS signals. This means the aircraft will not capture any GPS information. This will have an effect on the GPS-based position computation. The aircraft will be dependent on ground-based navigation aids, such as a VORDME or its own inertial reference unit, to calculate its position. Another system which is directly impacted because of loss of GPS is the ADSB. This unit sends flight data to ground stations for aircraft tracking purposes. What is GPS spoofing? GPS spoofing refers to sending false GPS information to an aircraft. When an aircraft uses this signal, the aircraft senses that it is at a different location, although the aircraft is in its correct position. This has an impact on performance-based navigation, PBN routes. The incorrect position will also impact fuel computation. It can trigger spurious terrain alerts from the enhanced GPWS unit. The ADSB will send wrong aircraft information to ground stations. Data communication would also be affected if the aircraft receives false GPS time information. GPS interference. Both GPS jamming and GPS spoofing are a part of GPS interference effects. To fly safely out of the interference effects, it would require timely detection and intervention by the flight crew. A few general techniques would be to cross-check the aircraft position by manually tuning a ground navigation aid or deselecting the GPS information or updating the aircraft position using ground navigation aids at specific time intervals. Because of the GPS interference effects, an aircraft may behave abnormally or trigger spurious alerts. It becomes crucial to understand the interference effects on the aircraft and take corrective actions accordingly. In places where these effects are observed frequently, a notice to airmen or NOTAM may be issued, which cautions the crew regarding these effects and a reminder to apply specific procedures. That's all for my video on GPS jamming, GPS spoofing, and their effects on an aircraft. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please share and subscribe, and you can continue watching some of my other videos as well.